Draw a circle. Hold it. Keep your back to the floor. Circle. Hold it. One more time. Now hold it. Bring your feet side. Other side. Put it between your feet. Flatten them. Add one hand. Now add the other. Down. Up. Down. Up. You'll notice our feet are straight up. So are our arms. Pulse rate is still up, right? Hello, good people. I am Tape Goat, and as many of you know, I'm in terrible shape. From sciatic nerve pain to, most recently, my ankle, which just gave out on me a few weeks ago when I was just standing around. It is because of these vexing issues that I have turned to the Dance and Grannies Exercise Program. That's right, everybody. Get ready to use our tummies. Tighten your tummy. It's a nice exercise to do. Let's get into it. Here we have the tape, everybody. On the cover, we have Beverly Gemignani and her beautiful face and her three granny associates dancing in a void of pink. It's absolutely ethereal. We do have a barcode right up here, everybody. We also have the thrift store barcode intact on the side. We have a little synopsis of the program as well as a list of the equipment that you're going to need. To. We have the badge for the Arizona Heart Institute because this tape is a humanitarian effort. Effort, these grannies are in fact angels. So if I take this off, ooh, a little stubborn coming out. So you'll see that there is no label. That is because the adhesive is worn away. I found the label flailing around inside the box. There you have it. There's the tape, everybody. Hello, I'm Beverly. I'm a wellness and exercise instructor for the mature person. She started in 1985, and really what these guys were known for is parades. They were, they were a national phenomenon who would travel state to state and do parades and, and do their dance and granny act. I'm sure that this exercise tape is really just an attempt to capitalize on their already established notoriety. So the tape starts with a quick roll call of all of the grannies as they are set up in this lovely, aesthetically pleasing formation. We're the dancing grannies of Sun Lakes, Arizona. And these grannies don't bait no pies. I'm Blanche, 67, 10 grandchildren. Adrian, 59, three grandchildren. Arlene, 66, two grandchildren. I want to preface this whole thing by saying this tape is absolutely iconic. Sort of like a tone poem, as they might say, but it really does have this elegance, this kind of like je ne sais quoi. I can't really put my finger on it. That puts it above other tapes. First of all, it was shot in a country club in Arizona, very specifically the Sun Lakes Country Club. I don't know if they dress the set themselves or if the country club kind of just already looks like this. The set is larger than life. It has this kind of sense of camp going for it. Big Cactus, meet Tiny Chair. Also, I have to mention the music. It sounds like they're playing it over the PA system. Now let your chin float down to your collarbone. The haunting accordion and the dissonant country music gives this piece the oeuvre of a avant-garde masterpiece, if you will. Use you your arms, waistline. Good, try the other side. Squeeze, lift, stretch. Use your buttocks. Now, think about most workout tapes. Think about what they normally play. Normally, it's kind of like upbeat, disco-oriented music, you know, to get people like pumped up and moving and stuff. Why would you choose something so bizarre and so discordant with the activity that they're doing? It feels like I'm watching a David Lynch movie. Normally workout tapes geared towards seniors are mostly focused on low impact and slowly paced kind of workouts. You know, given how porous and brittle their bones can be. This tape has that to a degree, but towards the end, they really start to amp it up a little bit. And trust me, I mean, After roll call, we get to know our queen, Beverly Gemignani. She also gives a few quick pointers on how to do basic mundane tasks without straining your back. Most of her advice is tighten your buttocks. Squeeze your buttocks. Tighten your buttocks all the way. Tighten that buttocks, tighten that buttocks. Send in the grannies. Yeah, you don't want this. Pulling this skin, making your own turkey gobbler. Remember to use your dummy. She says that a lot too, along with tighten your buttocks. Although sometimes it's dummy. 
Use your tummy, use your tummy, tighten your tummy, use your tummy, work your tummy, feel that tummy. Beverly then commands us to grab our balls so that we may do aerobics. Get your balloons or balls ready, get ready to do aerobics. Then we are introduced to another one of Beverly's delightful catchphrases. Short and choppy. Use your arms. Short and choppy. Everyone is coordinated pretty well, uh, although there is one part in the video where Blanche shits the bed and literally drops the ball. I mean, come on, Blanche. Try the other leg. How are they doing? Here comes the part that we've all been waiting for, people. It's the dancing portion of Dancing Grannies. We're going to do a little dance number now. Forward, step, side, step, back, step, one, two, three. And you can see how they earned the title of Dancing Grannies. I mean, look at them go. Body up. Soften those knees. Forward, side, back. One, two, three. It's pretty adorable. <laughs> Honestly, the way these guys dance, they just look like they're having such a good time. And that's really like, that's the vibe of this video is just having a good time no matter what age you are. After they get all tuckered out, we get a cool down, we get a stretch, and then they leave us with a very, very wholesome message. You know, you don't have to be good to start, but you have to start to be any good. Grannies and I would like to leave you with this thought. You're not where you should be, but you're not where you used to be. You're on your way, so you're okay. And then after all of that, we get a little powwow with the grannies where they each give their little testimonial uh, about how and why they joined the grannies. Say, Beth, do you remember about five and a half years ago when I first came to your class, I was a short, chubby girl who was very depressed. It's definitely meant to come off as unscripted, but I don't know. Do you remember my first leotard? Yes, Bernie, I do. <laughs> <laughs> it was hysterical. One of the grannies has a story where she basically said she woke up one day and her neck just stopped working. I still remember the day about eight years ago when I tried to turn my head around and discovered it would not go. And I was like, I've been there. So that's the tape. What can I say other than wow, wow, guys? Who watches uh, Dancing Grannies? Super grandmas are watching Dancing Grannies. Grandmas anywhere from 55 to 85, they, you know, they get up in the morning and they go power walking. They play tennis and they still have like a, a, a lively, you know, recreational life and they bench 250 pounds. I feel like John Waters would love this too. It just has this strong John Waters vibe going for it. Should you watch Dancing Grannies? Of course, it's wonderful. It's absolutely delightful. I love this tape because of its purity. I mean, it's all like you, you look at the cover, you see the Dancing Grannies, and that's what you get. You get Dancing Grannies. I know that this tape already experienced a little bit of fame because it's kind of used as a novelty gift. It has like a hardcore meme ability to it. Not to mention, even at my age, I am in need of low impact workouts that uh, won't destroy me. That's another reason I love Dancing Grannies because I can actually, you know, like stretch out, stretch out my busted ankle. And Beverly is a great instructor and she's an absolute goddess. So go out and pick up your tape today. Thanks for watching everybody. I am Tape Goat. You can find me on Instagram at I am Tape Goat. Always remember to use your tummy and keep it short and choppy. This is a Tape Goat warning. You better subscribe this time. All of my friends always like and share my videos. But not you. Why? Why not me? If you really loved me as much as I love you, you'd ring that bell. Don't be a fool. Feed the goat.